Tuesday, August 27th, 2013, and today I'd like to call it a victory. A uh, victory for those of you traders that have been following me and for those of you that have been uh, watching this uh, line with me. And, uh, you know, if you've been watching this line and uh, you probably watched it and noticed that when stocks broke it, they accelerated to the downside. That's exactly what we wanted to see. Uh, it's exactly what we wanted to happen. And it'll probably continue for the next uh, week or two. Uh, who knows? The market can turn around at any time, but I'm expecting it to kind of hit this region next. Uh, it's possible that it may come down to uh, this level as well at the swing lows. So we'll see if it hits the swing low of, uh, you know, 14,551.27 uh, here, or if it uh, comes down over in this region at, you know, uh, right around that uh 14,430 mark or 400 or 14,400 mark. So we'll see where it goes. Uh, I'm not really sure, but uh, it broke down in a lot of places. So checking the S&P, it broke down there as well uh, for a nice uh, 30 point or 26 point uh, drop. Looking at the stock specific, Apple again hitting that, um, you know, that high over here that I mentioned, it's just, it pulled back huge, $14. And if you look at the uh, the daily, uh, this was an awesome, fantastic day trade for those of you that day traded. I mean, basically right here, you notice that, uh, you know, it's holding support, holding support, bounced off that. Midday, boom, volume picks up right there, nearly double than the previous tick at the 10 minute. Boom. And from there, uh, when it broke that 500 region, uh, 499 it just accelerated and it went to 488 so 12 point run unbelievable amazing um you know netflix same thing i've been talking about netflix uh you know it hit the highs over here if you look at the last couple days right here it popped up trying to retest it couldn't do it uh you know it was acting weak just in general because of the market popped up and boom again sold off you know you, you sold it at those highs right there from that previous day you know looking at the uh, let's say 15 minute look at that look at the five minute right here you can see it it hit uh, a couple times right there boom so now right here at this high you sell some uh, shares and it just continued lower from 285 to basically 275 again a 10 point run Google as well, you know, uh, these stocks, they're breaking down. They're not doing fantastic, um, you know, and uh, that's what the market's giving you right now. So you ride the wave as best as you can. So here you go. Uh, again, broke down, continued lower. Amazon, same kind of concept. Amazon looking at the daily. Actually, I uh, was watching the daily. If you look at the daily right here, it's much stronger. So notice it was consolidating here for a while, broke out. I played that run very well, and I tweeted about that one. And then when it's coming down here, it tested it. Uh, you know, bounced off of it, and then now it just broke lower, and that's why it accelerated to the downside. So if you watch this, you can see that when it broke this region, again, it, it broke for uh, quite a bit of a, of a run here. Again, 284 to 280, four-point run. So those stocks, they, you know, they're definitely breaking down. The Netflix, the Apples, the Googles, uh, you know, they're not doing any uh, fantastic or amazing things. I mean, uh, just looking at JC Penny here from the previous day uh, as well, I, I talked about it. Just look at that run the last, you know, year here on JC Penny. They said that, oh, JC Penny was doing well today. It was running, um, you know, here. You know, it was popping up higher over here, um, moving, moving, moving. And then today they said, oh, it was popping up higher. So, okay, popped up higher, and then what did it do the rest of the day? Sold off completely. So these stocks, they're not acting well. Um, you know, if you look at the uh, the movers, the leaders, the apples, the Googles, those are the ones you want to track. Those are the ones you want to really follow. Um, you know, don't follow the, the crap stocks. Uh, Caterpillar, again, I had a couple people that talked about this one um just looking at it you know this is what this is this is what's happening i mean it's going from here to here uh, a lot of stocks are doing this so just stay close to your stops you know pay attention to them and uh if you're not good at shorting you, you might want to just take a breather but looking at the dow it broke this region and uh, i expect it to continue lower to uh, one of these two points we'll see time will tell